Everybody used to be being loud, hanging out, making moves all over town. Riding big cars, showcasing my style. Everybody wanna know what's going down. But that's not how I'm living now. I did a 360, turn my whole life around. Now I roll the cheese again, yeah, I like how that sound. I wanna go to heaven where there's no sin allowed. But since I converted and changed, people say I'm different since I came out the game. So they think I'm a lame But I don't care because I'm gonna work Hey my beautiful city, CC the Google Goddess I'm coming to you today with a double wig review The first wig I am reviewing is this one right here This is Fab Fringe And you guys, I did some things to her I just want to show you the cap construction and stuff Before I put her on uh, She has no combs in the front or on the side I don't think she came with combs I don't have the stock picture. I took her and wore her on vacation. I will nanotate a picture of the stock uh, card right here. Um, but I never reviewed her. So, and I will nanotate a picture of me wearing her the way I wore her on vacation right here. But again, this is Fab Fringe and she is in a color caramel, I think. I think this is caramel. Uh... Look, check the description bar down below because I will find the stock card. I, I know I have it somewhere or either I'll look the color up. Um, she has one comb in the back, which I did not show you guys. It's a comb right here at the nape. And with these short wigs, it, those nape combs are always good to have because they actually um, work as for holding the wig down in the back. Let me... Uh, Fix her a little bit here. What I did do, I um, I added some curls to her because, as you saw from the vacation picture, I had combed her out really, really flat, and I had like gelled her down and stuff. And so, I said I wanted to experiment with her because she is a great fall wig. You know, in the winter and the fall, I bumped some curls. I stacked them right here. Uh, I used my little mini flat iron. I purchased this when I went home a couple of years ago with a double. Uh, it was with a regular size flat iron. So, um, you know, a lot of times in the winter when we're wearing the turtlenecks and the different um, jackets and stuff with the collars or whatever, the high collars and all of that, our longer units get tangled up. So, I decided to review some short units. The other unit I'm reviewing is right here. This is Allie. Um, and she is really cute. We're going to change the color on her, though. We're going to do some stuff with her. We're going to change the color. Anywho, back to Fab Fringe. I really want to try to get this video under 10 minutes with both units. Um, she, You can style her in numerous ways. She's 100% human hair. And so here she is, ladies. This is the way I styled her. This is the side. This is the back. And ladies, I advise if you get these short units to get you an edge up in the back, get you a lining. This is the other side. She is longer on the one side. I mean, you can style her, like I said, numerous of ways. You guys know I'm not a fan of hair in my face. So... This is how I chose to style her. Um, you can feather her. You could probably put some little spiral curls here and just bring this around like this. Um, this is really a wow. Oh, I really like this, you guys. I did I just actually looked at myself in her. I had tried her on earlier, but I didn't really look. At her, I really like this. Is cute. This is really cute with my makeup being how it is today. This is just a really, really cute look, and she frames my face really nicely. So, again, this is Fab Fringe, and yeah, this is she would be great for the winter. I chose to wear her in the summer because you know, guys, it is so hot and humid. In Wisconsin that sometimes you just can't stand nothing to touch you. So I will be back with Miss Allie on in a snap. I'll be right back. 
Okay, my beauties, I am back with Allie. Both of these wigs are from the Sensational Collection. Um, this is the stock picture of Allie. She has like finger waves on the side and around the back. Let me show you. And so she is in a HL613. I thought this was a 27. Okay, she is in a HL613, which, um, like I say, you this is another one. You can uh, style multiple ways. She has this long bang. And uh, if you guys know my uh, friend, buddy, daughter, Jennifer Hudson has her hair cut really, really short like this. And uh, I think this would be really cute on a shortcut if, you know, you got, um, had your own hair finger waved and then um, styled, added some tracks to the front and styled like this. I think this would be really cute. Um, there we go. I want that to lay like that. And this color is a bit bright so i'm gonna show you guys a trick real quick of what i'm gonna do with her and i actually might trim her a little bit but i'm gonna try something here first and then we'll come back and see if we're gonna trim her this is rooks and it's fanciful coloring styling mousse this is really good for your synthetic wigs when you want to tone them down or even your own hair to uh, cover gray or whatever. This color is um, Fabulous Fawn. And as you can see, it's colored. And we're just going to tone her down just a bit. More in, try to get her more into a 27. Okay. And there we have it. I hope you can see the difference in the color. I didn't put a lot on there. Because I didn't want a lot, but I didn't want her that bright, bright blonde either. So, we've done that. And I like that color a little better. And so, actually, the most helped do what I wanted this to do, which was just tone this piece down right here. Because I didn't want it curly like that. So, I'm actually not going to mess with it. I'm going to take this and I'm just going to comb it like this. Um, probably put on some bigger earrings. And this is really cute. So here, this is Allie. And she is a uh, full cap wig. She has no combs, none whatsoever. She is, now Fab Fringe is 100% human hair. Allie is heat safe up to... 350 degrees. I did not, I have not put any heat to her. I was going to try to uh, tone this down a little bit. I have my curling iron on somewhere. Oh, that's what fell. Okay. So we're going to see because this doesn't have a heat temperature, but we're going to see what this does. Okay, this is cool. It didn't burn. Okay, so what you could do is you could actually, uh, if you wanted to cut a layered bang in her, you could, or just let her lay like this. Me personally, I would just let her lay like this and fluff this up some. Let me get the other comb so it could add some fluff to it. There we go. That's how I like her. So, yeah, this is really cute to me. And, um, again, this is another shorty do. And she's perfect for the uh, winter months. Uh, very, very stylish to me. I would probably, let me see, I don't have no gel out right at this point. But I like this laying this away. Like that. See how I did that? And, yeah, she's very cute to me. So, again, 
ladies, this is my double wig review from for some sensational shorty dudes. I did Fab French right here, and this is Allie from the Sensational Instant um, Collection. I actually purchased both of my units from uh, from off of We Love Wigs 2. It is a Facebook group from our Girl Thick 2013. I will post the link down below, and I will actually find, um, um, what do you call it, uh, Links where you can purchase these units from on your own. They are both inexpensive. I actually think both of these units are under $25. So these are great inexpensive units for your winter and fall months. You can wear your, uh, what are those, circle scarves, infinity scarves. You can wear your coats and your jackets without worrying about your the back of your units getting all tangled and knotted up. I cannot stand that. So anyway... Uh, this is CC, your frugal diva, and I want you to remember to be your own kind of beautiful. Have a be, be your that's right, be your own kind of beautiful. Have a beautiful, blessed day, and remember, tell somebody you love them. Don't wait too late. Later.